I am out of ideas. This week was one of those weeks where I just, I just couldn't get started. I didn't know what to make. I had no story to tell. I, I didn't have a single good idea. I know this feeling very well. For the past five years, I made 250 videos about creativity, about making stuff, and often I felt I am I am out of ideas. I am this is the end of my creativity. But eventually I came to a pretty interesting conclusion, and that is I don't need a good idea. I just need one idea. It doesn't have to be good because for me it's never really about the product, it's not about having the perfect result, it's all about the process. It's about going to the shop and thinking with your hands. It's about imagining something and then bringing that into reality. And I realized I don't need a good idea to enjoy the process. I just need one idea to get started. The only problem with this revelation is that even though I understand it, even though I know how it works now, it doesn't mean that I execute it. It's not like riding a bicycle. I have to remind myself of these things. I have to remind myself that I'm not dependent on having good ideas, that an idea or even a bad idea is good enough. A bad idea is good enough. And this is what this video is about. It's a reminder for me and if it's helpful for you, it's a reminder for you that you don't depend on good ideas. It's basically a celebration of all my bad ideas. All these little thoughts and brief moments of inspiration or, or quick ideas in my head or in yours, they don't have to be perfect. You don't need a good idea to get started and you don't have to reinvent the wheel. You just need this one spark that gets you into the shop or onto your desk or on stage or whatever it is that you do. Only this one spark and that doesn't have to be perfect. It just has to light your fire basically. As a matter of fact, I would actually, any day, trade one perfect idea against a thousand bad ones. A thousand bad ideas are more entertaining, have less pressure on you, will probably keep you going longer than this one perfect idea that we sometimes have a tendency to chase for whatever reason. Again, I just made this video to remind myself, to take some pressure off myself and I thought I'd share it with you and hopefully this is helpful for you as well. It's really helpful of me because at the end of the day I made a video this week, right? Even though I had no good idea. This week's sponsor is me. <laughs> I decided to take a quick moment 
and tell you about a podcast that I'm doing with my good friend Melanie Rabe. This podcast is in German, just a heads up, but we spend an hour every Monday talking to each other about creativity, about being self-employed, about working in different fields. She's a best-selling author. I'm a, I don't know, <laughs> a maker, a video producer, an inventor. I really like the term inventor. Um, yeah, and eventually we just decided to record these chats that we have because it's basically a little bit of a pep talk for the two of us. It's like, it's like you would listen in to a phone call with two friends. I just wanted to share it with you because I rarely promote the podcast. Um, but yes, if you want to give it a listen, there's a, there's a link in the description. Now, as always, I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's, it was a little bit different, but it was something that I, that I wanted to share with you. And I will see you next week with a new video.